ten minutes. I'm Josie Wales. I have heard. You're the Grey Rider. You would not make peace with the Blue Coats. You may go in peace. I reckon not. Nowhere to go. And you will die. I came here to die with you. I'll live with you. Dying is so hard for men like you and me. It's living, it's hard. And all you've ever cared about has been butchered or raped. Governments don't live together, people live together. Governments, you don't always get a fair word or a fair fight. Well, I've come here to. Give me either one, or get either one from you. I came here like this so you'll know my word of death is true. And that my word of life is then true. The bear lives here, the wolf, the antelope, the Comanche. And so will we. I will only hunt what we need to live on, same as the Comanche does. And every spring, when the grass turns green and the Comanche moves north, you can rest there at peace, which is some of our cattle and jerk beef for the journey. The sign of the Comanche that will be on our lodge. That's my word of life. And your word of death? It's here in my pistols, and there in your rifles. I'm here for either one. These things you say we will have, we already have. That's true. I ain't promising you nothing extra. I'm just giving you life and you're giving me life. And I'm saying that men can live together without butchering one another. It's said that governments are cheaped by the double tongues. And there is iron in your words of death for all commands you to see. And so there is iron in your words of life. No signed paper can hold the iron. It must come from men. The words of ten bearers carry the same iron of life and death. It is good that warriors such as we meet in the struggle of life or death. It shall be life. So will it be? I reckon so.